Well, hello, good people. Mark Holmes here. And as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. I'm here at the Red Brick House. We're doing some work here, uh, kind of basically setting up a portable studio here. We'll be live streaming tonight uh, for the Giants game. Hope you tune in at uh, 8, 8.15 for that. But we do have some breaking news here. Maybe some good news for the game on Sunday. Uh, Tyron Smith is making progress after missing the last two games with a sprained knee. He could, he could be back uh, Sunday or the following game against the Chargers. This is not a long-term uh, thing, which is definitely some good news for us. You know, the thing that's kind of interesting here is the Dallas Cowboys, surprisingly, I'm kind of surprised that they're only a three-and-a-half-point underdog. Let me say again, the Cowboys are only a three-and-a-half-point underdog. Now, that might be Vegas is trying to get more people to bet on the Cowboys, uh, excuse me, to bet on the 49ers, of course, because the line is so low, knowing that the Cowboys, you know, we got so many Cowboy fans that we're, we're always going to bet on him, them. But we'll see where it goes. Um, but I just wanted to try and do a little test here, see how this actually works, if this actually will upload uh, in any amount of time, because usually it's really, really slow here. Um, when you're uh, connected or not connected with the hardwired uh, in system. Um, yeah, so there we go. Tyron Smith may be playing this Sunday. Maybe some good news for the Dallas Cowboys. Um, as far as injuries go, uh, we don't seem to have anything else other than Micah Parsons, and we don't have any word on how that may be. And as soon as we do, we will bring it to you. All right, good people. I'll talk to you soon. Peace.